Good day everyone, my name is Dr. Norma Ozechi and today I'm going to be talking about cataracts and how they can affect the human eye, how they come about and so on and so forth. Now let's begin. What are cataracts? Now a cataract is the opacification of the natural crystalline lens of the eye. Now in every human eye we have what we call the crystalline lens and that is responsible for refracting light to the back of your eye from the anterior surface of your eye. So now when light comes into your eyes, it passes through a transparent crystalline lens for it to be able to reach the back of your eye. Now, what happens when this crystalline lens is no longer transparent, which is now what we call cataracts. Now light passing through that lens will appear blurry or appear hazy, or you might begin to notice um, dulling of colors, and a whole lot of other things. Now, what can you do or how do you find out that you have cataracts? It's simple. When you go for an eye examination, the doctor will do what we call an ophthalmoscopy examination. And with that, they are going to be able to have a good view of the inner structures of your eye, which includes the lens. Now, what can cause cataracts? For cataracts, um, we have a host of things that can cause them, but the most um, likely cause is usually due to age. Most people tend to have cataracts due to old age. Now, when we say old age, we don't necessarily mean that you must be old and grey, but from 50 upwards, in fact from 40 upwards, you have a higher risk of getting cataracts. Now, what happens with them? due to the aging process the lens becomes less and less transparent because every day every time you have new lens fibers being produced within the body of the crystalline lens so the older you get the more lens fibers you have within that lens and then before you know they start getting packed up in the middle and starts um, getting discolored and then before you know the whole lens gets discolored and then you have cataracts due to old age now apart from old age we also have due to trauma so when there is a heat to your eye it may be a heat maybe a gunshot just basically any traumatic experience towards the eye it can also result in cataract because because of that impact um that part of the lens that was impacted might now get opaque and then you have a cataract also we have um, diabetes now in people that are diabetic due to the increase or constant fluctuation of their blood sugar level the lens undergoes changes and also becomes opaque so then you have opacity due to diabetes apart from that you also have opacities due to smoking now smoking as we all know is very is bad for our health generally but then it's also bad for our eyes because it can cause things like cataracts or rather it increases your risk of cataracts now what happens when you have cataracts what can you do about it is it the end is there is there any remedy now for that what happens when you, when we examine you and we notice that you have cataracts is that you the solution to it is to undergo a surgery and in that surgery the opaque lens is going to be brought out and the new lens is going to be put into the eye a new synthetic lens is going to be put into the eye so you will now find out that your vision that was once blurry is now clear and bright again and most times um the surgeries have a very high chance of success with cataract surgery so it's something that has a remedy and is something that you should not be scared about as well other things that can be done is also to take antioxidants antioxidants are basically supplements for your eyes that just cater to the vitamin and mineral needs of just your eye alone now with these things i hope you are able to understand what cataracts mean and how they can affect you and how they can be treated thank you have a wonderful day